Okay, so this is the section where we're going to go through setting up a SQL database. Um, most web hosters have some kind of a control panel like this. Um, I use HostGator, I also use Bluehost, and I also use iPage. Um, all of them have the same thing. And if you scroll down, you will eventually see the MySQL section, the databases section. And what you're going to want to do is first you're going to want to go into MySQL databases and you're going to want to create a new database. So we'll just create a new database called My Game Scores. All right, so we'll create that database. It's created, we'll go back, and then you want to assign a user to that database. If you don't already have a user, you can create a user um, right here. And your username in this case is this is my login name and then underscore and then whatever the username is so I'm just gonna pick one that I've actually already created so I have one that's just uh, my handle arcade at arcade at, and then I want to assign it to that new database which is my game scores so I just click add and then you want to give it all privileges so make changes so make sure you know the password for that account and so the, the things that you're going to need to know from this page are the database name, which in this case is arcaded underscore my game scores. So we're just take that and copy it into a notepad just to have it. All right. So and then you need to know your username, which mine is I'm using this one here right still with me and then whatever the password is for that okay password for that account okay so now you have the database set up you want to go back to the main control panel and go to back to databases and PHP my admin you know this is kinda of where you go and you can set up the databases so here's all the databases I have and here's the new one uh, my game scores so we're going to click on that and get here and then I'm going to pause and we'll come back and I'll show you how to create the tables for this database.